Hello there! So today, a part of having sick voice, I gonna try new 4th star legendary modifications. Polished gives plus 60 if the condition is maxed. Bullies gives plus 50% weak point damage if you are not using VATS. Somehow polished buff is a damage multiplier, which is great I guess. Uh, and uh, here we have the same everything but with conductor's legendary modification. So you can see that. But uh, first let's see the difference between free aim and ultra aim. Can we get more or less the same numbers? Because here we have plus 60% maximum versus plus 50% weak point damage. And nope, bullies got bullied by polished was gameplay. Almost two times stronger and crits give quadruple damage with quite basic buffs like better criticals, ego ice mutation and the tweak receiver. But what about conductors that gives no damage buffs? It actually works like medics legendary modification and we use prime receiver with bullies that gives extra two points. So let's see how damage numbers will be different in this case. Well, turns out shots with no follow through, no tenderizer somehow are better in case of conductors just because of explosive number. 38 versus 20. But wait, why am I dealing less explosive damage in free aim? Am I missing something? Well, let's start and finish with one thing I got super wrong about bullies effect. Turns out we just randomly deal 50% more damage when attack weak point of our enemy. As I understood, in case of Puppy Hulk, we are talking about headshot. And what I didn't understand, why the effect is random. Why Bethesda? Why? I mean, honestly, it feels like you are giving the worst crap to players who are rejecting stupid auto aim instead of rewarding them for not using it. So, I think bullies should be reworked. To compare weapons, I used this perk loadout. It's more suitable for Vascrit build, obviously, but we care only about damage numbers. And uh, bullies legendary modification, well, sucks. I mean, even in case if we are dealing only headshots, bullies is already crap. Because extra damage is not guaranteed and we really need something comparable to VAT's criticals. Or even be stronger a little bit. I absolutely agree that having extra increased damage to a weak point is a good idea. But let it be like this in all cases. Okie dokie, let's compare free aim with auto aim once again. And here you have it. Vats vs bullies free aim. I go with 200% critical multiplier and uh, it is stronger. Would you believe it? Personally, I would make bullies three times stronger because it is a no go for me. AP usage for ultra aim abusers will be compensated with need to deal headshots or just weak spot hits. Critical damage on steroids will be stronger. Yeah, anyways. I think uh, that's all for today. Big thank you for watching. I will see you later. Bye bye bye. Bye bye.